Hey guys, name's Fen playing some Ultima Ratio. I'm supposed to clear this freaking lady's name over here, but I don't really know how, so I'm gonna leave it to last as any good, responsible, mature fellow would do when asked to do something important. Okay, so I found Cripplewood's place, but I don't have a key. I need to find the element of the three powers, take care of High Priest Nestor. Don't have the key to the hammer place either. Oh. Uh, Read Kilgore's letter on how to sabotage the factory. Wait a minute, I did that. What? I did do that. That was in the very first freaking video. What the hell? Letter from Kilgore. He told me how to sabotage the factory. Maybe that is supposed to read actually sabotage the factory. So, the only place I can think of to go immediately where I don't know for sure that I'm blocked is the factory so let's head up that way now let's see I am over here so I gotta go all the way up and also there's a library and there's a dancing Burrick oh I guess I haven't been there either yeah see that shadow is not lit but the sunset is <laughs> something's funny and it ain't BBC 2 oh hey it's three more cops see this is what I'm talking about yeah <laughs> If this was Thief Gold, oh, I think you can't be taken out there. No, you can't. Is this a Thief Gold? The front guys would be alerted. Because weird. Okay, so there's the marketplace, which I guess is there. Yeah, there's Cripplewood, so the factory's there. Library's there. So it looks like there's almost like another street. It almost looks like that wall is a wall. Wait, is this a real door? No. But. I think you can't do this in old man's link. Yeah. That, okay, so maybe the library is accessed from the other side. Or maybe it's just nothing. It's just marked on the map like, whoa, 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 whoa. better be taffing around down here. <clears throat> hey, your citizens ain't panicking about me. I don't know why you professionals should. Oh, oh, man, you guys. Something exciting is about to happen. Oh, that's the crippled Burke. Or, or the crippled something. Oh, it's objective. Stop pressing the objective. It's the dancing barrack. Is that sign a dancing barrack? I can't quite make out what's on that sign. You know? No, it's a guy holding a book. So is that the library then? Okay. Dancing barracks on the other side. How the hell would I... Oh, I would have to go all the way up there. Okay. Sorry for... Sorry for... Sorry for... Sorry for reading and existing and... Oh, finally. Hey. Maybe I'll stop in for a little light reading. Or heavy reading. Heavy. <laughs> I could get some metal lyrics from these books. And there's the red light again. <laughs> Death is shining in from the windows. Yeah, well, it's just a library, library. And neither a borrower nor a lender shall ever read a book again in his whole entire frickin' life. So, of course, like all libraries, the main thing is that you steal the money. Well, you borrow it, but, uh, you know, hey, kind of the same thing. I'm borrowing it until I spend it, at which point it won't be mine anymore, so, hey. What? Uh, huh. Well, that's interesting. Where the hell would I get a key for a bunch of mechanist lockers? in a library. Well, I don't know, I guess I'll leave that <laughs> here as well. Uh, so yeah, I guess I'm heading to the factory, not the Cripple Burrick, then... Oh, fine. But wait, the Cripple Burrick is a meeting place, so... I guess the factory is not to be left till last. Fine! This is an on-the-fly mission. I'm flying by the seat of my pants. My pants have a seat so you can sit upside down on them. It's, uh, it's pretty kinky. But hey, why not? It's utterly safe. Nobody ever got hurt by sitting on somebody else's pants. Unless they were awash in cyanide. And you ate them. Hey. Who am I to judge? Okay there, buddy. Never fear, I shall spy the adversary long ever That's right. It's a hammer factory. With wooden doors. That's how you know it's hammer and not mechanist, because the doors are nice and wood. New St. Tenor factory. Well, if he's St. Tenor, why isn't he singing the song 
a factory drum. It goes like this, cling, clang, cling, clang, making a factory, are we? That's all you do, you just repeat that over and over. Uh, finally, I found work here, and I have to say that this job is not bad at all, as it may have appeared at first. All I have to do is to sit the whole day in the entrance hall. Most everyone here is friendly, even the boss. Maybe I could even ask him for a raise if I continue to sit on my ass and do nothing well. The second day was even better than the first. With some of the guards who are on patrol within the building, I even chat here and there. Rupert told me of an army of zombies near the harbor. That is when I asked him from which fairy tale he has taken this information. He then hit me over the head and told me what a fool I am. Sometimes jokes go a little too far. Zombies. Yeah, right. Is that something a hammer would say? <laughs> this morning I was searching some boxes in the back alley when I found a key. I knew that other people's properties are none of my business, and that is why I left it where I found it. During our lunch break, the boss mentioned he had lost his safe key and if someone had come across it. Since I did not even know what kind of key I found this morning, and surely it cannot be the safe key, I did not raise my hand. After our break, the boss seemed sad. Why, I wonder? Maybe I should help him? How about that? I am told I need to work the night shift tonight. Rupert told me to be extra vigilant tonight. Whatever! I will make myself as comfortable as possible on my chair and take a nice nap. In case something should happen, I am sure that one of the others would wake me up. Oh, hey. <laughs> that book is, is goodly. Oh yeah, the books are starting to be goodly laid out now, I guess. Dude, realize. So, there's an alley somewhere or other with some boxes. Is that what he said? Boxes, boxes, boxes. Some boxes in the back alley, so do I actually need to go out the back doors to find the back alley? Perhaps. Hey, this looks like the where. Oh yeah, I think. I think it might be this mission. One of the missions I played recently was like, hey, one of the bits is based off the warehouse from shipping and receiving, and I guess this is probably it because obviously, yeah. <laughs> Alrighty. Hmm. I I I know your I know your door there. Fully aware. It's pretty impressive, I know. I'm kind of interested in finding the back alley. Though, yeah. So, I do have the two explosives, and I'm guessing... Well, okay, let me see if... Well, this is... This is a back place. Oh, oh, I see. So you could probably go to search the crates. Let me see if I either have to drop them or if I have to put them in a specific place. I would guess I have to put them in a specific place, like, by frobbing them on and stuff. No, I do have to drop them. Oh, and there's the key. <laughs> okay. Well, hey, it's labeled safe, so if you pick it up, you'll automatically know what it does, so... Okay, so one of them... I guess the east and the west sides of the factory, so just place them, like, friggin' anywhere, maybe? Anywhere generally in an easterly or westerly direction? Yeah, alright, okay, so, uh... We'll just head into, uh... Easterly direction over here and see how far east I can truly go. That's weird though. You'd think it would be a specific spot. I mean, I guess this is the most easterliest part, so these hallways, I guess you just place them. That seems a little weird. It doesn't seem like. Also, I don't remember which one is which. Let's see. Number one on the west, number two. Okay, so this is number two over here. Princess Butt for a face abides. Again, that, that doesn't quite seem uh, as extravagantly gallivantish as it should, but, hey, whoa, who am I to say? Hey. Hey! Oh, hey. I, no, I'm nowhere near. Never mind! So, we'll see if this harebrained scheme does function here, let's see. Come on, man. Yeah. Well, really? Unless there's... Oh, wait, no. That's not the most westerly part. And I reckon that other place probably isn't the most easterly part either. Okay, I guess that makes a little bit more sense. So over here. It looks like there's something past that door. Due to the fact that it's all red and glowy. Really? So that's it then, is it? That is really weird. That is so... Like, you'd think you could just frob it into, like, a place that you can put it in, I mean, I don't know, okay, let me see if there's a similar hallway over this side, but, oh no, that light is from there, okay, fine, I'll bet there's something in some of these crates if you rope up, but hey, needs must in other areas, wow, that door is lit bizarrely, 
I have never seen doors as bizarrely lit as in these places here. No, there's not. There's not another hallway here. Well, I don't really understand then. I mean, what? Am I not... Am I not done this right? Maybe I can get more easterly and westerly by going upstairs. There is an upstairs, right? But look, don't you want to place explosives near the foundation on the bottom floor? Is, isn't that how you do it? Well, what do I know? I guess I'll try going upstairs and see if there's anything any more obvious there. The author's just like, ho oh, oh, ho, I'm going to make all these doors to more easterly and westerly directions unfrommable. Oh, I'll we'll never be able to do the thing now. Yeah, so... I mean, there's these portions here, but why why logically would I really want to place it upstairs? Something just doesn't feel like I'm correctly doing this here. I do feel like I'm somehow doing it wrong. I mean, <sighs> it's nonsense. Hey, I'm here now for some reason. I'm not sure why in there. So loot. Okay, so I did look it up because I just wasn't sure what I was doing and if I was doing something wrong so yeah because it's, it's just weird because seriously the I guess the note doesn't say the absolute most easternmost side I mean the west part the east part that could be anywhere you know and especially since there's this hallway that I mean this is the westernmost part but I guess you don't place it there instead for Inexplicable reasons, you place it, I think, in this room, just like anywhere. Oh, what's your, just anywhere in this room, I think. Well, let's wait for that dude. Yeah. I don't know. It might be this room. Let me see. I'm looking for some glowy stuff. Yeah, I think it is. Yeah, why would it be this room? This isn't really, I mean, it's east ish, but I mean. I, I don't know. If you're going to be that vague, then it's not really possible to... I mean, you mean like somewhere between center and east. Maybe it's like the easternmost full room that's an actual full room. Hallways don't count. I don't know, man. It's it's pretty weird. Oh, hey, I guess I... Why did I... I did not reload. Why the hell did I... Weird stuff's going on. Okay, so, and then the... For some reason, the west room is one of these. Upstairs. Not that clear. Personally. Well, there should be like a big old room with an arrow. Put it here! I mean, I know that would be a little silly, but, uh, also... Aren't both of these rooms kind of... Oh, no. Not at all. Okay, so it's this room. Okay. 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 <laughs> All right. Why not? And I think there's also still going to be that. Yeah. All righty. So almost 4,000 in loot. Couple of thousand left to go. And many things that I'm leaving for later. A bit too many. You might, you might question. Hey. <laughs> That's a heck of a secret switch, man. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's pretty big. Although I guess I'm not complaining because non pretty big switches are not pretty big. Hey, it's a fire arrow. Interesting. I wonder what the deal. Also, did I get the safe key? Doing my safe? Yes, I did. Sunspark. Sunspark. Oh right, that's his jewel. Hey, that's that's that that's that jewel that was used in Norman's bequest. I think. Hmm, interesting. Master Vrind, first let me thank you for the invitation. Hang on, who is this? Yeah, to the ceremony. The menu was amazing, and I also very much enjoyed our discussions regarding future productions. But now to a more serious topic. Even when I arrived, I noticed that security seems to be lacking around here. For example, one of the warehouses had a door that was wide open and facing the street. No guards were anywhere to be found. Further, during my tour of the facilities, all doors to the main factory were unlocked. To be a bit more clear, anyone can enter and exit as they please. I expect that at my next visit things will have changed considerably. And no, I will most definitely not pre-announce my visit, Priest Nikolai. Oh, looks like someone's in some trouble. 
Yeah. So it's a secret with loot and a fire arrow. Fire arrow is a funny thing to find in a secret. But, okay. So, door onto the street that's wide open. I don't remember anything like that. The door onto the street was closed. I guess maybe they fixed the problem. Excellently done. I want to take this plant with me. I've got nobody else to dog do. Nobody else to dog do. I know, you might think plants have plant do, but they don't, because they're not animals, they're plants. See? They've got seeds and flowers and sometimes fruits. And sometimes, hey, this room is kind of just nothing. Awesome! At least the doors don't disappear. Her, her. Oh, I guess that's it. And then, alright. Fair enough. Fair enough. Wait, where did I... Where's the stairs that I came up from? Is it this door? Did I come from here? Yes, I did. <laughs> so, let's see. Nestor. Is High Priest Nestor not here? How do I know who he is? I don't think these guys are named. Hmm. Okay, well, I do have this Gustav guy's key. Gustav's room. Is that a room in a hotel? Is that the third room? Oh, I see. I, I didn't... Did I get the key to that room? I don't remember. I got some key. Didn't I? I did. Oh, that was the key to the gate! Hey, what are you doing here? Holy shit, I swear. What? How? <laughs> How? I don't really remember the names of the people listed in the ledger. I just I don't have a memory for that sort of thing. But I guess Gustav might be one of them, so... Hmm. Why not? I suppose. Why not? But I'm out of orbital juice, so it's time to just do a quick cut. Ready and... Oh, that says Luna Azure. Not Azura! Ho ho! Hey, pretty pretty too. Man, given that this, uh place is something you need to get back to, presumably. It's pretty stoop difficult. Quick cut! Okay, so here, here I get to discover, if I'm right, let's see. <gasps> Gustav Hardwick, yes! That's him. Alright, that's weird. Why did they make it so freaking hard? You can't even get back through that window. Like, you saw me try. Okay, though. Okay, though, is this it? Room three? Yeah. Alrighty. What? <laughs> okay, also I want that jewel dagger, but sure, okay, what do I got here? Oh. Murders, however, do not know about solidarity. The one who stole needs to also pay for the murder. So, I can't prove the innocence of the accused. But, why not? This is a guy, whereas the accused is a girl. What? Oh. Dear diary, I cannot tell you what feelings ran through my body today. Feelings of absolute comfort and happiness. And I have to thank her. What an amazing woman. So shy, but yet so sincere. I owe her everything. And her eyes. <laughs> I could look at her the entire day. But guess what I find the most attractive? She's a professional thief. Never would I have thought that a person who defies the law could fascinate me the way she does. Her stories are so unbelievable that one has no other choice but to fall in love with her. I cannot think about anything else. She is on my mind all the time. I would do anything to free her from her current situation. Anything! If I tell her that I want to free her from her previous life and to begin anew, will she embrace me? Will she kiss me with her full lips and will run her smooth fingers through my thick hair? I'm brave. I will then carefully place her onto the bed and... The next few paragraphs you skim over. Thank you, a mercy. Today there is a special meeting. Not in public, as, the, as in the cafe. No space. Rather, very discreet in one of the hotel rooms. There I will attempt to propose to her to... Offer a new life. I do not own very much, but two people should be able to bear this much easier. I can barely wait to see the tears of joy streaming over her beautiful face. Of course she will say yes. And in case she does not, she would have to kill me to get rid of me. Ah. <laughs> well, you know, I think that the City Watch will find it most interesting to find this book within its possession. 
So she did kill him? Oh. <laughs> so much for all of that. I guess she was guilty after all. Welp. That's funny. <laughs> that's that's like a good bit of misdirection, that. All right, but yeah, seriously, what a jerk. I guess back in these times, men were permitted to be jerks. Now, they're permitted to be mocked on YouTube for, for that sort of thing. Whoa, what a crazy punishment. Okay, so that's... That's that. Done. So I go back to the cop station. Okay. And... Quick cut. And another. Okay, but seriously, on their desk, I think is what he said. I'll just place it down places. Places until uh, until I find something. I don't know. Oh, is that it? Uh, my diary on there. Hmm. Okay, I guess it ain't there. Then. But. But, but, but does that prove anything, though? That guy's just like, she'd have to kill me. Herp, bedurp, 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 bedurp. I don't know. I don't remember what Garrett just said. It's in their possession. In their possession. It doesn't necessarily... Okay, it didn't say anything about a desk, did it? Maybe... Maybe I'm not supposed to do anything? Weird. Because... Why did Garrett say that then? Was he just saying it to say it or what? Eh, maybe here? <sighs> Garrett, why did you say that then? Oi! There's some loot. Also, there... Hmm, might be so, oh, sure. So again, I looked it up in the thread, and apparently, yeah, you don't do anything with the diary. Garrett just says the City Watch would like to get their hands on this, but then not, because apparently that thief in the beginning that the guards were running after was Anushka, so this whole thing was pointless? Sure. <laughs> Hang on. Looks like I never went in the waiting room. Funny. Funny. There's a badge on the wall. Hysterical. It's midnight, hysterical! Also, why do people talk about the second gate? There's no gates at all here. I had... Uh, bed... Bedrooms... Oh boy. Oh, this is a bedroom. There's supposed to be a key in here, looks like. I don't know. Interrogation rooms, did I not go in here either? Well, 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 well! Seriously. Alrighty then. Well, it's just a bunch of interrogation rooms, and by a bunch, I mean a couple. I mean, obviously, you know, interrogation rooms. Not the torturous kind, the modern pleasant kind where they give you M&Ms and Skittles and watch you bloat. Oh, I see. Confusion! Never mind! Oh, and there's the dead thief. There. All the way there. Where the hell am I even? Wow. Oh, okay. Wait a second. If she's over here, how did she get from the start? There's a big old impassable gate. Unless there's a lever, that would actually make more sense. Right? Oh, there is! God damn it, Fan will no wonder. Okay. <laughs> Let's just ignore that little embarrassment. So I think I may have missed something here, I think. So there's a bedroom. Which would be not... That doesn't look like a bedroom. Perhaps it's over here. Yeah. Wait, did I even read? Yeah. It's the, it's a meme audio thing. And there's a key you can barely see. Library locker number four. Only one of them? Where the hell's every other key in existence? Ah, oh, well. Well, I guess I looked stuff up now officially, so pff, to my morals. <laughs> a flash bomb. <laughs> wow. So, yeah, I'm probably going to want to look up secrets after I'm done, if I happen to miss any, which I almost certainly will. But, okay, what do I really have to do? Nestor. What the hell is... Well, there's that other Hammerite place. Maybe he's there. Hmm. And Cripplewood, which... Hmm. Well... 
There's still the dancing bark, but you know what? I think I'll leave that till later. So for now, well, I'll see you guys next time. Bye for now. Whoa.